on the show, we really like to bring you things that are different. And this is certainly different. In fact, it's a one of a kind. It's a man with the superpower memory. His name, Harry Lorraine. <laughs> From the accent, you can tell he's American. Yes. And you were supposed to be on the last show, but forgot to come. I did. Forget that's a, <laughs> that's a Just briefly, I should point this out to our viewers at home. Briefly, and I mean briefly, before the show, you happened to meet each of our guests here tonight, taking part as a jury. Yes, I did. And I understand your claim is you can remember all the names. Well, I hope so. You hope so. Yeah, shall I, <laughs> shall I try? Yeah, go on. All right, go. perhaps it would be easier if they stood as I called the name. If I get your name right, you can stand up, uh, uh, stand up, okay? We'll go from the back row. This is Mr. Parrish Sam Patton. If you would stand up, if I have it right. And this is Miss Penny Hooper right here. This is the one you had a little trouble with uh, before, Paul. I believe it's Shug Sahadevan. And right here, it's Miss Pauline Stratford. This gentleman is, is Mr. Norm. Uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Paul Norman. Right here, it's Mr. Daryl Brown. I believe there are a couple of Miss Evans. This is Miss Audrey Evans, and uh, this is Miss Sue Evans. Right here, it's Vic Atkinson. And this young lady, I believe, is Frida Rawlings. And while I'm in this area, it's Eileen Scott, Peter Swan. I believe this is Fiona Bay and Doug Bay, Mr. and Mrs., I assume. This is Shirley Phillips, and this last gentleman is Mr. Bob Dawson. Okay. <laughs> do that very well no, I mean, no, I mean, <laughs> actually actually I use my systems uh, there's no trick to it it's a system of memory that I use that anybody can use it's paying attention see most people claim they forget names people don't really forget names what they do is they don't remember them in the first place as a matter of fact take it a step farther back they don't hear them in the first place it, usually, the way you're introduced is Mr. Daniel, say hello to Mr. Ponce. Mm -hmm. Oh, I've met him a lot. Yes. <laughs> you, you hear a mumble, right? Yeah. And obviously, there's no way to remember a, a mumble, but what most people do is, is they don't do the obvious, which is to simply say, I'm sorry, I didn't hear your name. There are a couple of reasons for that. I think one is they think it's embarrassing, which it isn't, of course. But most important, I believe people think, what the heck, I'm never going to meet that person again anyway, so why bother? Problem is they do meet that person again next day, next week, next month, next year. And that's why half the world calls the other half love, governor, buddy, captain, mag, darling, sweetheart, buddy. Not because they're so enduring, but because they don't know who the heck they're talking to. But that's, that's all right, because the other half doesn't know who's talking to them. So we all go through life with the blinkers on, you see. Yeah, but what I meant was how do you remember the name? Uh, how well, do you remember my name? Well, I, I would picture a friend of mine named Dan who's yelling. Dan yells, Daniels. And perhaps he's yelling because Somebody's pulling him. Pull reminds me of Paul. Paul Daniels. It sounds complicated out of context. It really isn't. It's quite simple. Uh, something else that I happen to know, I don't even know whether the jury know this or not, but very briefly, as people were coming in, you met one or two. Yes, I met a few people. You met audience. a few people out of our audience. Now, these few people that you met, you claim you can not only remember all these names, but while you've been remembering those names, you can remember the names of the few people you met. Well, I hope so. Yeah, oh. so do we. Um, now, I, I wasn't here at this moment of time. I was away, but I know that people were going past you were saying, excuse me, what's your name? Whoop, and they're gone. Right. Right. So, the few people that, that, that Harry met, I don't know where you're sitting, but would you stand up, please? Just, just the few that gave Harry their name. Would you, would you stand up? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Harry, I, I think I'm going to go and, and lay down. I think I'm going to join you. <laughs> Let's no, no, join me. Join them. Ladies and gentlemen, Harry Lorraine. Right. Yes, thank you. Thank you very much. I had no idea that I had met so many people. As a matter of fact, I think I still see one or two that I did meet who are still seated. Of course, on the other hand, I see some people standing that I know I never saw before in my life. In any case, one of those people that I did meet are deciding whether to stand up or not. Let me tell you what I would like to attempt to do for you, and I stress the word attempt. I'd like to try to remember the names of everybody standing right now. But not only do I want to remember your names, I'd also like to try to remember your faces. So what I'll do is I'll call your name and point to you at the same time. So please, don't sit down. Don't sit down until I've called your name and pointed directly to you. 
Okay, as a matter of fact, if you'd like, if you could all kind of face toward me, as some of you are doing anyway, it would be easier for me to see your faces. And I'll try to get you seated as quickly as possible. We'll start right over here. This is Mr. Seif, right here. Right here, it's Mr. Lazarus, Mr. Sood. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Right here, it's Mr. Dome. This is Mr. Johnson, right here. It's Mr. Howard Oakley and Gaynor Oakley. And then it's Mr. and Mrs. Oakley, sort of one above the other, right there. Let's jump over to this side. This is Mr. and Mrs. Hutchinson. Right here, it's Mr. Weston. They've been shifting you around a bit, haven't they, Mr. Weston? I met you up there. Okay, as long as you don't change that lovely face it doesn't matter right here it's mr and mrs da silva this is mrs matthews mr frisbee and another miss matthews while i'm looking in that direction that's mr brooks bank is it not way in the back i know i'm gonna mispronounce this but let me get as close as possible Bosaska. did i get it right i think i said it better than you do okay uh the, the trouble is and this my eyes are so good on a clear day i can just about see my glasses i can't oh it's mr reed right here and this is mr lomas who was sitting over here before this young lady, it's right on the tip of my mind. Yeah, don't sit down. I'll get to you in a minute. But while I'm thinking of that, I see Miss Butterworth and Miss Brary. I hope I pronounced it correctly. Miss Todd. I'll get to you in a moment. Yeah, don't sit down. Uh, right here, it's Mr. from Denmark, I believe. Mr. Peterson, Mr. Johansson, right over here. Uh, now, this is Miss... Uh, Mrs. Ward, and right here, it's, uh, they gave me the first names, I want to get them right, it's Sybil and Mabel Burr, right? Sybil and Mabel, sounds like a comedy team. Right over here, <laughs> it's Mrs. Gillis, and this is Stuart Gillis, right over here. While I'm looking in that direction, that is Mr. Dick, right there, I see Mr. Winter. This young lady is Miss Brown, there are a few other Browns, don't the others sit down, but right here, it's Mr. Davis. I see Mr. and Mrs., I want to pronounce this correctly, Canolti, accent on the can, right? Uh, he got very excited about that. Okay, and uh, right here, it's Mr. and Mrs. Borcutt. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. I'll get to you in a moment, dear. Don't sit down. Uh, right here, you two have changed seats, haven't you? But you can't change faces, Miss Camden and Miss Hurley, right over here. And right here, it's Miss Smith. Yeah, you can sit down. I don't think you're too sure. I, and right over here, it's Mr. Frost, who was originally sitting here. You really messed it all up here, didn't you? Okay. And, uh, wise guys. And Mr. Brown, and there's another Mr. Brown, and that's Mr. Hill. And right over there, it's Miss Kingdom, with an N at the end. Uh, while I'm in that area, well, this is the Walla family. It's Mr. Walla, skip one, Mrs. Walla. And then it's Lucy Walla and Louise Walla. Did I get that right? Because you're still standing. Sit down. Uh, right over here, it's Mr. and Mrs. Edwards, another switch of seats we have here, right? Miss Adam and Miss Parkins. Now you can switch back again. I'll get to you in a minute. Don't go in. Uh, right over, it, it'll come to me in a moment, or you'll get tired, whichever comes first. Right over here, it's Miss Bradney. Now here are some more Browns here, right? It's it's Miss Belinda Brown. This is Miss Jackie Brown. That's Mrs. Brown, Miss Mesa. Uh, right over here, it's Miss Merritt. Oh, Miss Sweet, you can change back with Miss Whitehead. It doesn't matter where you sit. Oh, boy. We got the... I'll get to you in a second. Uh, right over here, I believe this is Mrs. Carrie, and this is Mrs. O'Flanagan. There's a Mr. and Mrs. O'Flanagan, and right over here, it's Mr. Holt. That is Miss Reeby, and then there's Mr. and Mrs. Holt. And while I'm looking in this direction, Miss Payne, Mr. Gordon, Mrs. Harris, Miss Harris, Mr. and Mrs. Chambers, Mr. and Mrs. Hardwick. Uh, right here on this side, I believe this is Mr. Hooper, Mrs. Jordan. Right over here, it's Miss Day, Miss Bean. There's another, this is Mr. Merritt. Is it brother and sister or man and wife? I don't want to get you in trouble. It's all right. right? Now, right I'll get to you in a moment. I really will. Uh, right over here, it's Miss Atkinson, Miss Dickinson. A lady came in at the last minute, and I wasn't listening too well, but I believe it was Maskell. Have, have I got that right, Miss Maskell? While I'm looking in this direction, Mr. Yeager, Miss... Uh, uh, wait, I got that wrong. You're being very nice. It's not Yeager. It's Braga. Thank you, sir, for being so kind. This is Miss Tilden Smith, hyphenated, you know. And right here, it's, uh, it's Mrs. Warner, Mrs. Treadgold, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Pegram. Have I got that right, Mr. and Mrs. Pegram? This is Mrs. Wil Wilcox and Mrs. Scott right over here. Oh, boy, I'll get to you. In, in a uh, right over here, I have Mrs. Cooper and Mrs. Akers, and this is Mrs. Baker and Mrs. Ives, and this is Mrs. Uh, Mr. Taylor, Mr. Emmott. I hope I've got that right. Mr. Passingham, right there. Way at that end, as long as I'm looking there, it's Mrs. Smith, Mrs. Munzer, and Mr. Smith in that order. This is Mrs. Skeels. I hope I pronounced that correctly. Right here, you took your jacket off. You'll try to look different, right, Mrs. Francis? Won't help you. I, and right over here... I hope, you know, it's my American accent, I said Francis, but I believe you said Francis, and I want to, and I want to get it right. Uh, now, right, whoops, right over here, that's okay, as long as the memory doesn't get hurt. Uh, <laughs> right over here, I believe this is Mrs. Ward, and now there's a Miss Ward, and this is Mr. Greenstreet right here. Now, I've got just a few here, and I would like to call you off. Uh, ah, this is Mrs. Dick, belong to that gentleman way down there, right? You can sit down, this is Miss Hornsby. Right over here, it's Miss Waters, Miss Bullen, Miss Hill, Miss Buzzing, Miss Curzon, I know I'm gonna mispronounce this one, David. Let me try. Protopapa. I got it right, Miss Protopapa. Okay. While I'm in this direction, 
switched wives on me, didn't you? Okay, it's Mr. Tanner, Mrs. Hine, Mrs. Tanner, Mr. Hine. Now you can go back. Uh, yeah, and this is Miss Williams. Miss Williams, and this is Miss uh, Hamid. Did I pronounce that correctly? Right over here, it's Mrs. Weatherhead, Miss Weatherhead. While I'm in this area, uh, uh, on this end, Mr. Lunson, Mr. Roberts, Miss O'Neill, Miss Nolan, Miss Foxton, Miss Alt, A-U-L-T, Miss Slap, double P at the end, right? And Mr. Sanders, I've got just this one road here I'm gonna have to get to you, sir. Uh, right over here, it's Mr. and Mrs. Crouch, Miss Jones, a likely story. <laughs> I believe this is Miss Sims. Now, I know it's the Dickinsons, but they, they did throw their first names. I mean, I believe it was Gladys, Tricia, and Betty Dickinson. And way in the corner is Mrs. Bates. Now, I have just this one young lady. Dear, what was throwing me, what the, <coughs> excuse me, see, I had my nose fixed, now my mouth doesn't work. You know what <laughs> uh, It was the pronunciation. You are Miss Onufrio, are you not? Miss Onufrio, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you.